Hello everybody, Ken here, welcome back to Mad Max. We've arrived in this lovely new stronghold with old Gut Gash. And uh, I guess we've got to go up and interact with him and see what he wants. Now it looks like this one is going to be locked until we complete a certain amount of tasks. But we'll go and take a peek and see what he has to say. Oh. Please. 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 Hello. The child. It's the burning sickness. What are you in here for? These just prisoners? The fan. Give it to me quickly. Mm. Come on. This fan seems just awful dangerous. Mess around with that stuff. Don't touch the merchandise. She's got it. Hope. Take a look at hope. Whatever it takes to survive. Whatever it takes to keep my glory alive. Conceived in the days of the early fall, Hope is the daughter of the history woman, Miss Giddy. Oh, I'm a bit Miss Giddy. Miss Giddy's husband was killed by a biker gang, and she was taken pregnant as a trophy by their leader. And uh, Hope was raised by the gang, but then they were defeated by Immortan and Joe. Uh, he kept them as breeders, which is, uh, if you've seen the Mad Max film, is kind of... He, Immortan and Joe has this troop of women uh, in Fury Road who he uses to breed children, which is terrifying, and kind of that's a big crux point of the film. Um, she was, uh, apparently, I guess Hope failed to produce a son, so she was given to a, a lieutenant, and she ended up, uh, being taken to Gas Town. Dr. Dementis took her from Gas Town, and, uh, Hope gave birth to a daughter, Glory, and, uh, Dementis was killed by Scrotus. Hope and Glory were sent back to the Citadel, but they escaped when the transport was under attack. Uh, and then they ended up... <laughs> God gosh, so not a good time for Hope and Glory here. It's a, a sad tale. Let's have a look at Gut Gash. Let's see what it says about Gut Gash. Out there, the ocean waits. Ready to come a-crashing and cover these lands anew. We will be ready then. Gales of glory will fill our sails. The leader of the Rust Bastion, which is a fantastic name. That's the uh, this ship that we're on. Suffers from the recent surge in aggression from old Stank Gum. We do anything to stay afloat, including dealing with marauders from Gas Town. He recognizes Chum Bucket's mechanical skills, but doesn't trust him. Okay, well let's see what he has to say. I want to know why he's keeping those people hostage and what we can do about it. Gutgash, now I think we'll probably stick with Jeet for a while, but this guy, this guy could be trouble. I know. Sense. Trouble here. Dismantle a camp in his territory. Reach Day Lizard Legend Rank. We've reached Day Lizard Legend Rank. Still got a lot to prove, boy. Okay, so we've got to clear out a camp in this region. Can we just jump down here? Doesn't look like it. Uh, we'd probably take a, a whack of damage doing that, I guess. Can we not go back in here and deal with these people? No, I guess not. It's a shame. I feel bad about that. This is just um, those parts we can collect. Okay, well let's... I guess let's go chat to uh, our friend here. Can we talk to someone over here? Do one of these people have a quest for us? Or is it... might be the person up next to them, perhaps. Next to him. Let's get in the car. Let's go uh, clear a camp. And then maybe we can talk to Gutgash. Maybe he'll actually listen to us. Right. On the road again. Looks like there's an informant I just here. If we destroyed these unholy camps of the scrotus hordes, then they treat us like kings around here. Ugh. This is, uh, this is unpleasant. Okay. Looks like somebody's just collected some stuff. Maybe they'll be willing to share it with us. Some s cloudy smoke over in the distance there. 
Hello. Good day, friend. How's it going? I carry no weight. Stanky Gummo. Look for sheltered gut gas tribe. It's turned away. Better off. Here's something big is coming. Something destructo grand. Warlord Stanky Gummo is gonna bring the kill to the Oh wow, okay, Stank Gum's gonna Stank Gum's coming for Gut Gash. Oh Gut Gash could be in trouble. Good to know. Definitely good to know. Right, let's drive carefully around this poor wastelander. I don't want to trouble them. We gotta find ourselves a camp to take out. So this is Gut Gash's territory, this big area here. Now so far we've only seen one Ooh, what's this? Death Run. So this is some kind of race, I guess. Find and mark a saltpeter source. To be the same, I imagine. This isn't a camp. This is a scarecrow. Maybe if we head down to this, we'll be able to scout the area and possibly pick up a uh, pick up a, a trail of a camp that we can go after. Seems reasonable to me. Brum brum. Crunch. Okay, we've got to make it up the top of this rock, and it looks like this is the path around. Freedom. <laughs> Freedom indeed, my friend. We can cut up here, right? Yeah. That's rather satisfying. Long shot stalk this region, Saint. Be on guard. I am being most cautious. This guy might have seen us. I think that might be why he's red. Ow. He gave us the beans. Oh, we haven't got any ammo. Damn it, I thought we'd collected some ammo. That's disappointing. Right, get in there, man. It's alright, we don't need to deal with that guy. We can get him later. I wonder if he'll attack us while we're doing balloon stuff. I'm going to presume not. That would uh, be a little harsh. I guess that's the thing we can slide down out we hop right looks like we're gonna have to explosion required okay there a gas canister around we can make use of thunder stick an explosive weapon that can be thrown or impale with enemies at close range No? Apparently that explosion wasn't close enough. Try it again. Thankfully there's like a hundred thunder sticks here apparently. Maybe we need to be closer. There we go. I guess theoretically we could take one in. But I'm not going to bother. I, I don't think we'll need it. Like this history relic. Mum, oh, I know you didn't want anything to do with us, but little Brienne wants to meet her grandmother. Love, Janet and Skylar. Poor little Brienne. They had something. And now it's gone. It's gone no matter how much they loved or hated or bigot. Right, nothing else to be done here, just a, just a balloon to ride. What's that noise? Is it just a generator? Guess it must be. Wait, hang on. This balloon's already up in the sky. Find and refuel the generator to activate the winch and bring the balloon down. I've got to refuel the generator. Where the sodding tits do I get fuel from? There's none over here. We might have some in the car. I'll have a look. It doesn't look like there's any here. I guess there could be some just over here, but it seems unlikely. Although, 
I don't know, if you were designing this, wouldn't you want to keep some fuel near the thing you need fuel for? We're going to have to take what's in the car. I'll just be borrowing this man. I'll, uh, don't worry, old chum. I'll, I'll bring it back. Oh, I'm not going to bring it back. It's a lie. I won't, I won't bring it back. Oh, there's fuel in here. Great, well, we'll just leave this one here then. It's okay, there's fuel inside. Don't worry. I'll put it back. We'll keep that for later. Won't be a sec. Sorry about the bother. I'm just going to do some balloon stuff. If I'd seen it, I would have taken it up with me. Because you almost always need fuel for these balloons, it seems. Da -dum, da -dum. Da -dum, da -dum. Do we fill up here? Do we fill up over here? Or maybe we need to Let's drop this down. Can't interact with that thing. Where do we fill up? Why can't I pick this fuel can up? Damn it! I put it too far in the corner. Oh, this damn video game. It's not even respawning. Why are you doing this to me, game? Why are you doing this to me? Don't do this to me. Oh, Jesus. Fired my gun by accident. Which out of sheer frustration. Alright, let's just take the one out of the car. I've injured myself. I'm frustrated. I'm going to have to use this. It's all gone wrong, Chan Bucket. It's all gone up the pisser. I'm not going to lie. But uh, I'd like to think it's not my fault. The game's kind of dicked me around. You know sometimes when something's just a little bit too close to a wall and you just can't pick it up for the life of you? A bit like that. And normally these things you can fuel when you're like on a specific side of them. Doesn't seem to be the case here. Oh, here we go. No! I'm just going to fill up with this burning fuel. Well, it works. <laughs> Perhaps not in the way one might traditionally anticipate, but it, it worked. Here we go. I'm a little bit singed. Don't mind that explosion, chum bucket. <laughs> I'm I'm fine. My beard's a little bit shorter than it was before. My eyebrows are gonna take some regrowing, but it's fine. I I finally got the balloon working, so that's good, right? God, we made a real test of that. <laughs> I told you that refueling was gonna come in, uh, gonna, gonna cause a problem at some point. Oh, we're sitting duck for that sniper too, if he wants. Parch Moon. Sounds like a wizard. It's a hope. An old ship. And the hunt of the teeth. I know, I've been there. So have you. You visited it. I say you, so have you. I am you. There's a camp. Oil transfer camp. That'll do. That's just the saltpeter, I guess. I wonder if we even need to mark out the sniper. Nope. We know he's there because he did sniping stuff on us. We can probably just swing around and kill him with uh, the harpoon, even though we don't have a sniper rifle. Weak scarecrow, sniper. And then back to gut gashes. Du -du 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 -du. Right, well, the first course of action is probably to take out the sniper over here. We'll just drive up to him. He's on the crossroads. Uh, mm, he might be too high up. Unless we can find a way round the back. He might be a little bit too high up to deal with. Hopefully not, but I, I would anticipate that he is. Now we need to find the camp that we want to go to. Where is that oil transfer camp? 
Do do. Do 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 do. Here's where Griff is at. I guess you probably got some tokens for Griffa. Scarecrow, Scarecrow, Sniper, Intel, Sniper, Scarecrow, Loot Encounter. I don't know. I don't know which uh, Scarecrow. There was definitely one around. Oh, it's this thing. It's the white thing, of course. That's why I was confused. I was looking for red, uh, red icons, and it's the white one. <laughs> uh, I'm not a complete idiot, Chambacket. At least not always. I really want to harpoon this guy. No, I don't think we can. I wonder if he damages the car, or if he damages us directly. Uh, so, Saint, uh, where are we headed? South. Did mark the battle sites. Where can we find sulfur? Oh, uh, the yelly smelly? <laughs> Chum knows. Yeah, Chum Chum. Uh, I'll show you. Oh, the old yelly smelly, of course. And we could do with some water, too. Is there water nearby? Have a look on the map. Uh, there'll be water in the camp, I'd imagine. I'm slightly cautious of these guys coming up here. Hopefully they're just going to drive straight past. They did. Roadkill approaching. Roadkill? Oh, he must be talking about the people uh, in cars. I want to talk to this guy. Ones are armored up. Is he just like peering at that sniper? Don't stray. All right, mate. How's it going? You know that sniper can probably see you, mate. You're just lying in full view. Um, crazy eyes. I read your soul has ill will for these scrotus minions. You think you only reach their fort from the bridgement, but no. You can also use zip zap line and sail down there to slay. They need a lesson in losing blood. I want to use the zip zap line. Some fuel tanks are suspended on cranes. There's a defended bridge. History relic at the camp's dead end. That's not really surprising. Where's the zip zap line? That's what I want to know. Is it marked on the map? No. But you have to imagine it's at one of these higher points, right? Can we maybe get to it up here? I wonder. I'm going to try over here. It seems like somewhere it might be. There's definitely something over here. Dun 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 dun. I'll be back later, chum bucket. Oh, there's a fucking sniper right here. Ha! Jesus! I'm on fire, mate. I've got no water. Apparently I had a little bit of water. I don't have much water. Right, I'm just going to go for it. This might not work. But it's my only chance. Oh Jesus, there's explosions and everything. You can't do the Batman dodge, which is kind of worrying. Oh, Jesus. Okay, that didn't work. The zip line, it was implied to be like a safe way in. <laughs> but he didn't mention there were things that throw fire. I kind of want to work out what it is that's throwing fire. Burn his line of fire. 
This would be nice if we had some uh, some of the sniper bullets, to be honest. Which I thought we were going to get. Right, okay, let's... Uh, what we'll do is we'll go find water. That way we're... Uh, more well equipped. And I think there was some water over here somewhere. But I could be mistaken. No, I think I was mistaken. There's water up here, but this is a long way away. Hmm... Let's go to this scavenging location. Maybe we'll find something nice. We'll come back to that camp a little bit later. I want to make sure we're adequately prepared for it. Scarecrows still stand. That they do. But it's not on our direct path and I'm not prepared to deviate for it right now. I don't really want to get in a fight here. We might get in a fight here. No, they decided not to chase us. And you know, I guess sometimes from their perspective it's not necessarily worth it either. Oh man, how do we get up here? There's got to be a way around. There's got to be an entrance somewhere on this. Here it is. The unnecessary roll, Max. Okay, where we go? Let's see what's in here. Got to be some nifty treats, maybe some sniper ammo. Yeah, there we go. Scoop it up, ba 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 ba. Kind of nice. Little flaming torches. Um, hi. I like what you've done with the place. Sadly, I don't actually see where the thing we scavenge is. Aha. Uh -huh. Must be over here somewhere. Gotta guess we gotta climb up this. Is there anything over here before we do? The chair. Just a chair. Nothing going on. Do do do. This is a weird like platforming section. Whoa. What's going on in here? A couple of dead peeps. Some mysterious hearts on the wall. A lover's retreat perhaps. These lovers no more. Quite sad really. Another sad tale of the wasteland. Well, there we go. That's Mad Max for you I guess. Right, I'm coming out, chum. Just hang on in there, son. Maybe he's not going to trouble. It's car like actively waiting for us. Now. Yeah, you want some head on? We got head on protection, son. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Ugh. Uh, this is a weird way of doing stuff. Oh man, that's nasty. He clipped us right in the back. Yeah, they don't want to head on. They know how that went for them last time. Bump and grinder. T-bone that guy. Oh, there's water over here. That's what we want. Get ourselves some water. Oh, this is nasty. Aha! The old runaway tactic. Not into a bear trap, though. 
I imagine they're chasing us. But it's fine. Got ya. Oh. Bam. You want some? Do you? Do you want some? Not today, thanks. Crikey. Okay, well, we'll nab up this scrap. The old Bantam hauler. Let's have a look at it. Let's see what that is. Camp outpost to secure Kudo for gas town refineries. Protected by da 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 da. Bantam haulers move medium amounts of fuel. So it's a convoy truck of some kind. Collect this scrap. Boom. Now there's water around here somewhere. I saw that much. Oh, there's ammo as well. Fantastic. Oh, a sniper round. That'll come in handy. Just one though. Ammo is super limited in the start of this game. I'm glad we managed to fill up our canteen though. Looks like we didn't drink all of it, so I'm going to try and top up our health. And see if there's any more water left in here. Yeah. Now have a little bit extra out. Probably not coming back here anyway. I wonder if those guys left old chum back it alone. Or if uh, we're going to have to give them the beans when we get back out there. Whoa. Yeah, he must have talked them out of it. Now, come on, gents. Let's all be reasonable here. We're all civilized, grown men. Okay. Well, we got water. We got food. We haven't got food, but we don't. We can't carry food anyway. Why can't we carry like a? We should be able to carry like a tin of food as an emergency ration. Got to be a way into this camp here as well. Maybe it's up above. Now I do see. I do see a, a sniper, but I don't know that I necessarily want to. I don't know that I want to deal with a sniper right now. Like I don't want to. I don't know that I want to waste my sniper bullet on one guy. Is it down here? I found it. I found the way in. Get out there and fix it. That was all I was meant to do, right? Oh, no, I didn't mean to... No, I didn't know what this was. Oh, I should have looked first. Don't do that, Max. How do we get out of here? Ah, a tunnel. A tunnel ahead. Perfect timing. Easy. That wasn't too difficult at all. Don't know what I was worried about. Okay, well I guess we should head back to that camp then. We should we go see Griffa? Let's go see Griffa. Freedom! Freedom! Easy does it. Wait. Can we can we pull this down with the the old harpoon? No. We can't ram through that. We can harpoon this. Oh I see, so it's just not strong enough to pull it down. Okay, well we need to come back with a better harpoon then, I guess. Let's go uh, head over towards Griffa. And uh, we'll talk to him, but we'll do it on the next episode. Thanks very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to pop that like button. Subscribe to the channel for more Mad Max. Plenty of other stuff too. Drop me a comment down below, of course. I've been Ken. I hope you have a fantastic day. Thanks very much for watching. And I'll catch you next time. 
Cheers. Yeah. <laughs>